Hi, I'm Vanessa Ramirez, where I'm a native from Phoenix, Arizona, where I was born and raised in the Valley of the Sun. I have my degree in communications from Grand Canyon University, and currently I'm focusing on hosting, modeling, and acting full time. I definitely love this career. I'm definitely enjoying what I'm doing right now. I love entertaining people, I love meeting people, and I'm always on the go with nonstop energy. So this career is perfect for me. I've had a chance to do some independent feature films. I was a spokesperson for a local TV station. Um, I've done some you know, reporting as well, and this is just all fun. I'm loving it, and I would not trade it for anything at the moment. I'm Vanessa Ramirez. Check me out on qualitystocks.net. Welcome to the Daily Stock Report, brought to you by Quality Stocks, where performance is tracked daily. I'm Vanessa Ramirez, and for Tuesday, October 7th, we're bringing you the latest news from around the markets. Today's headline news are brought to you by Performance Health Technologies Incorporated. Performance Health Technologies Incorporated is focused on developing and marketing performance evaluation and rehabilitation products that monitor and guide exercise while giving instantaneous motivational feedback. For nearly a decade, the company's computer and medical experts have innovatively combined advanced software and medical technology to create motion track. Let's get into the headline news from Monday. Oil dropped more than 6% to below $88 a barrel yesterday as global market route churned concerns that faltering fuel demand could slow further. In other news, major markets in Europe, Asia, and Latin America sank yesterday as traders looked past America's bank bailout bill and focused on Europe's growing financial crisis. The markets opened up this morning with the Dow down 369.88 or 3.58%, the Nasdaq down 84.43 or 4.34%, and the S&P 500 down 42.34 or 3.85%. And now for a look at the market news quality stocks is tracking. Market headlines are brought to you by Bright Strike Technologies Incorporated. Bright Strike Technologies Incorporated was started by two police officers who believe the top manufacturers of tactical lights do not meet the needs of police officers. The company is committed to using the very latest technology while abiding to the highest design and manufacturing standards. The Quality Stocks Daily Newsletter would like to highlight Spansion Incorporated as our one to watch, up 7.69% with over 1 million shares traded. Founded in 1993, Spansion Incorporated is a leading flash memory solutions provider. Headquartered in Sunnyvale, California, they dedicate their efforts to enabling, storing, and protecting digital content on wireless, automotive, networking, and consumer electronics applications. OPEXA Therapeutics Incorporated up 9.38% with over 344,000 shares traded. OPEXA Therapeutics Incorporated focuses on auto log cellular therapy applications of their proprietary T cell and stem cell therapies. Their lead product is Tovaxin, a T cell therapy for MS, which is in phase 2 to B trials. It is a T cell vaccine for MS that is tailored specifically for each patient's disease profile. Southern Star Energy Incorporated down 2.99% with over 34,000 shares traded. Southern Star Energy Incorporated focuses on strategy to acquire under-drilled oil and natural gas leases which have proven development drilling opportunities. Once they acquire these opportunities, the company works using of all available technologies to increase the value of these assets. And that's our newsmaker. Stay tuned right here to the Quality Stocks Daily Newsletter for the latest news from small cap to large cap and everything between by Quality Stocks where performance is tracked daily. Please be sure to see our disclaimer on the Quality Stocks site. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Vanessa Ramirez, and you have a great day, and we'll see you right here on the Quality Stocks Daily Report.